Question uh, around the NFL and especially the AFC side of the NFL uh, is when is Lamar Jackson going to make his return? When is he going to come back? When should he come back? Um, because I think yesterday's game could have possibly altered uh, when he will return. But at the same time, it may not have because not everything is set in stone. While the Ravens did officially clinch a playoff berth yesterday, which is great, which we're super heavy about. I love it. Um, but while they did clinch a playoff berth yesterday, amazing they're in they punch their ticket in it's official um they still could change their playoff seating could change they could actually get a home playoff game that could happen that's still in that's that, like that's still a possibility a real possibility too uh because in order for the ravens to get a home playoff game all you got to do is win these next two games that's it win these next two games Nothing the Bengals does matters, whether they win against the Bills, which is very possible because the Bengals are hot, or whether they lose against the Bills, which is very possible because the Bills are the Bills. So that game, I mean, that game, if they lose that game, it could help you out a little bit earlier. But you is looking like the, the Ravens and Bengals week 18 game. I mean, well, technically week 17. Well, their 17th game of the season. Last game of the, of the year, it's looking like that's going to be for the division. That's what it's looking like it's pointing to and what it's headed towards. And, I mean, that, it's going to be a tough one. It's going to be a tough – ooh, that's going to be a tough game. Um, but if Ravens went out, they win a division straight up. If they win these last two, they, they win a division. They, they would get a home playoff game. Um, and I know there are a lot of people that say, oh, well, no, uh, Ravens play better on the road. They, they, I don't want them playing at home in the playoffs. Me, I would. I would definitely want that home playoff game. I want it for, for the fans to get to see the Ravens play in the play. And I know some fans are like, oh, we don't want to see that in person. No, you, you still want to see it. You still want to see that. Like the home playoff game, a game at M&T Bank Stadium, like, come on, man, that's special. That's real special. Um, and regardless if you think they play better at home or play better on the road, still, man, it's playoffs. So you got to bring it. You got to be prepared. You got to be on point. You got you to gotta come right. If you, don't, if you don't come right, you're going to get left. <laughs> you're going to get left behind. So um, I think you want that playoff game at home. Because you, you're going to have to go on the road regardless. Like the road game, you're only going to have one home playoff game, and that's it. You ain't going to have no more. So you're going to have to go on the road anyway. But why not try to get at least one home playoff game at the crib, man? Um, but would, would that change, like would, would where the Ravens are sitting at right now in this position, would that change Lamar for when he returns? Would that change when he returns, I mean? Uh, let's read the report that came out before the game yesterday from Ian Rappaport. He said, Ravens quarterback Lamar Jackson will test his sprained knee this week, determining if he can make football-related moves and practice. If he can practice, he should be healthy enough to play. But what's at stake could play into whether he actually plays. Uh, and he talked about that. Um, and then again, this was before the game. So he talked about how if the Ravens clinch the playoff spot, that could make them be like, all right, well, Lamar, we ain't got to bring you back yet. We ain't got to rush it, anything like that. You could chill. Or if they didn't clinch a playoff spot yet before the game yesterday, then or at, even after the game yesterday, then they, they could have been like, oh, man, uh, well, all right, Lamar, come back. Come back and be our hero. Come, come, come save us. We, we need this playoff spot. But now the Ravens are in a – not even necessarily a tricky spot, but I mean, kind of a tricky spot. I mean, if Lamar is, is healthy, if he's good to go, if he's 100%, he should be the one out there. <laughs> he obviously gives them the best chance at winning. And with Lamar, too, another thing, I, I, don't, I don't think it would be a good decision uh, to be like, all right, let's keep Lamar out until the playoffs. I, I don't think they should do that. Uh, even if, if, if he's healthy and they'd be like, all right, we already clinched a playoff spot. Tyler Huntley, you just go do your thing. No, I, I think that if Lamar is healthy, you should get him out there. Reason being because you want him to get into a rhythm as early as possible because you don't, you don't want his first game back to be the playoff game because you, you, don't, you don't want him to be out of sync, out of rhythm. You want him to be as in tune and in rhythm with the offense as possible because Ravens, I mean, we know how their offense is. We get it. Trust me, we get it. Um, that's why I said y'all saw how Robert Kraft flew out that Patriots fan for, for what he had to deal with as a Patriots fan in that Raiders game. Steve Vichotti need to be flying out a bunch of us for what we've had to deal with with watching this Ravens offense. But anyway, um, we, we know what Ravens offense is and they can't afford to be out of sync any more than they are. I mean, 
sometimes the players can be out of sync. We, we saw Andy Isabella in his first game yesterday where he ain't know what was going on. And I, I can't fault him too much because he just hasn't been out there. I'm sure he's been in practice and stuff like that, but live game action is much different than practice. And he, he was just lost. He was lost on that play where they, they didn't know what was going on. He didn't know what was going on. People were trying to tell him, hey, look, uh, and he was just standing there. So he didn't get it. Uh, and then with, with Greg Roman, like it – we we going to talk about that later on but th there's the times yesterday's game and plenty of games before too where one thing's working and they go the exact opposite direction it's like that they go against the grain for no reason but anyway so my point is ravens need to try to get as many things in sync as they possibly can and the earlier the better you don't want to get to a playoff game and be working out kinks and stuff like that not to say it's not it's impossible but I think it would be better for the Ravens, better for Lamar, better for the running backs, the line, the pass cap, better for everybody if he was back before uh, the playoff game. So he could just get into the flow a lot sooner, a lot earlier. Um, but we'll see how it goes. But I, I, um, I would think that they would bring him back um, if he's ready. Like if he's like ready, ready, then I think they would. Now, I, I do think... Um, Against the uh, the Steelers, especially with this being the next game that they have coming up, um, I think they would they would think about it. Like I think they were they were really really want to make sure Lamar is all the way, because again the most important the most important part of the process of the regular season is done. The most important part of your regular season is finished. Is is absolute. Is final. Is verified. And what I mean by that is you have your Ticket to the playoffs. You're in. That's the most important thing that you try to get from every single regular season. Get to the playoffs. So we got a shot. You got your shot. So now you could be like, hmm, with Lamar, if he's, if he's like 75%, you know what? We'll rest him for the next game. Let him get closer to 100. Bring him back for the Bengals game. You, you, the pressure is alleviated. It's alleviated, especially since you're going against the Steelers. Especially since it's them. And, like, I, I would hope that the Ravens would execute the game plan that they executed against the Steelers two weeks ago. Even though you know Steelers are going to try to really come with it this time and try to execute it better on defense. But, you know, Ravens, sometimes they, they get into their own heads when it comes to offense. But, anyway, we, we talk about that later in the post-game thoughts video tomorrow. Um, but you have options. You have options. Um, so I, I could really see them being like, all right, Tyler Huntley, you, unless Lamar is like over a hundred percent, I can see them being like, all right, Tyler Huntley, you up against the Steelers, Lamar, you'll be back next week. I can see them doing that. I, I can see them bringing back Lamar if, he, if he's all the way, cause you know, Lamar gonna want to play. Yeah. <laughs> you, you know, he gonna want to play. Uh, cause just, just to really get back out there with his guys and stuff, you know, he gonna want to be out there playing. So if he is clear to play, because again, I know some people thinking it's this whole little business thing, like, oh yeah, Lamar sitting out to prove a point. I, 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 I just don't, I don't think that right now. Again, I, I, I never thought that, especially with the situation that the Ravens are in and where they were in even before yesterday's game. Because I'm thinking like Ravens are like so close to the playoffs. Why wouldn't he want to get back out there and try to finish what he started? So I, I would think that that's his thinking. Like, all right, I want to get back out there with my guys. I'm trying to make something happen in the playoffs. I want to take us as far as we could possibly go. Uh, and we'll, then we'll see what, what happens from there. But anyway, what do y'all think is going to happen with Lamar? Y'all think he's going to be back for the Steelers? Or you think he's going to be back for the Bengals? Or you think the Ravens are going to be like, hold up there, buddy. you only coming back for the playoffs. Y'all let me know. Uh, just like Lamar has been the past couple of weeks when this came to playing in the games, we out. I love y'all.